Well, good morning, everyone. So, I, I know you all love a health and safety announcement here. So, Faith has told me, this little red glass pebble on your seat, you are not allowed to eat that. I never even crossed my mind that anyone would think to eat this. But they said I had to begin the meeting with the disclaimer. You are not allowed to eat this. Do not eat this. If you think about eating it, don't. Is that clear? I didn't want to eat it until you told me. No, not to. I know. Now, no, just no. get that full of your mask on and just set up your barrier to eating a bit of glass. Don't eat glass. That's what you have to take away. I just like to say, oh. I just like to say, I'm so glad Grace is here. <laughs> well, good morning. Welcome to worship. We welcome those that are watching online as well. <coughs> and we've reached our fifth and final of our frontline services today, where we're thinking about how we can to, how we can grow together, or together we grow. And the frontline series has all been about reimagining our front lines, our mission field, where we spend most of our time as a Christian, as a church, which. As a diagram we've seen popping up by week by week, isn't normally all together gathered. It tends to be, if you're one of those little red dots like the one that's in the meets, most of the time, most of your week, you spend not in this building, but all over your place on your own front line as a scattered church. However, that is not to say there isn't a place for the gathered church like we are today. The gathered, coming together and gathering together is important and we come together like we do this morning to worship and sing praises to God. And it's Psalm number 8 in the song that we're going to be using to begin our worship which says, Come, let us all unite and sing, God is love. So we're going to do that this morning, united as a gathered church and proclaim God's love today. Some of the eight in the summer book, and I invite you to stand if you're able. <coughs> 